Hey guys, in this tutorial we're going to be looking at the rotate around function. So if you wanted one object to rotate around another object, you could use this script. Um, if you're doing like a space game where you want uh, orbiting uh, planets and stuff, you could use it for that. It works best for objects that aren't moving that are stationary so that the rotation doesn't change. I've seen with uh, moving objects it, it can uh, change a little bit depending on how fast the player is moving and such. But for now, um, we're just going to test it out with our moving character. You could adjust the degrees, and I found that at higher speeds, um, it doesn't move around as much, or it doesn't expand outwards more. So we can go and take a look at our script real quick. We're going to be using uh, transform rotate around, so whatever this uh, script is attached to will be the thing rotating. Um, target position, the object you want to rotate around, and vector 3 up, it'll send it in like a circular motion, and degrees is just the speed at which you want it to travel. So we can go in here real quick, I could show you how the script, or what it'll do. You can see that the object is rotating around the player, and if we move, you can see that uh, it kind of messes up the rotation for whatever reason. I've been trying to figure out how to fix this so it's uh, stuck in in a certain uh, distance rotating so it doesn't change at all, but I haven't been able to figure that out yet. But you can go in here and do different stuff with this. Uh, I was experimenting with this a little bit, and you can get the object to stay in one position and spin if you wanted. So here we have the object spinning a certain distance away from the player and it'll always stay locked into that position. You can adjust the different settings to uh, get to spin differently, uh, different locations and such. Or we could do different stuff like, we'll just cross this out real quick. Maybe we wanted this code set to forward instead. So now it'll be rotating in a different uh, direction around the player. But you see how the objects don't really follow the player for this. So it's better if you used a stationary object. I'm sure I'll be able to figure it out so it can spin around in any direction uh, without changing how it is. And then you could also do stuff like combining both of these together to create like a uh, different kind of, maybe you wanted to rotate around like that <laughs> instead. So yeah, there's a bunch of different things you could do with this. Uh, you could turn into a mini game having uh, spinning objects go around and maybe you want your player to dodge them or not get hit by them or anything really. It's up to your imagination, I guess.